Alice, what do we know about the accused so far? Well, Ali, Harvey, Ali is a 25-year-old British man whose uh, father uh, was a former advisor to the Somali Prime Minister. Now, prosecutors allege that Mr Ali travelled from his home in North London in Kentish Town. They allege that he made an appointment to see David Amos at his constituency at his surgery, took the train there, um, made emails, made an appointment, and when he was there, they allege that that is where he stabbed and killed him. What we do know is that Mr Ali was arrested at the scene. Now, the Crown Prosecution Service alleged that the murder had a terrorist connection because of a religious and ideological motivation. Now, prosecutors say that Mr. Ali was affiliated with Islamic State and that he had specifically targeted Sir David Amos because of his record on voting on airstrikes in Syria. Now, we do know that Mr. Ali was referred on to the government's anti-radicalization program as a teenager. That's called Prevent. Uh, but he was not thought to be on the radar of the security services MI5. It's understood that Mr. Ali was allegedly settled on a plot to kill kill uh, an MP two years ago and initially focused on looking at two other MPs. Mm, OK, now, what are we expecting to actually happen in court today then, Alice? Well, Mr Ali, he's accused of murdering Sir David Amos, but he's also accused of preparing acts of terrorism uh, between the 1st of May 2019 and the 28th of September of this year. So both those charges will be put to him and he will plead guilty or not guilty. We don't know whether he will be here in person. He was when he attended Westminster Magistrates Court in October, but with COVID cases so high, it's not sure whether he will appear via a video link. If he does and if this does go ahead and the defendant pleads not guilty, uh, to any of the charges, then the judge will most likely set a date for the trial.